This is the Cash Builder Well. Each correct answer is worth £1,000. Wish you luck. Your time starts now. Which of these is a former country that has won the FIFA World Cup? Correct. Which of these managers led the England team furthest in a FIFA World Cup? Correct. In which decade did Brazil win its first FIFA World Cup? Which of these London 2012 venues was furthest from the Olympic Park? Correct. Which footballer was nicknamed the non-flying Dutchman? Correct. Which bone did Wayne Rooney fracture in the run up to tooth? Correct. The famous French race the Prix du Jockey Club is run at which race course? Which of these items? Out of time. That's good. Time to face the chaser, but who will you be up against today? You could be playing the cinnamon, more irritating than a thistle in your thong. Or perhaps it's the governess. She had a fall at the weekend, actually two falls under submission. Could it be the vixen, hot and clever, like quiz night in the sauna? Or are we playing the dark destroyer, the only man who doesn't like Monopoly because it's over too quick? Could it be the beast? Now he's been big since he was a baby. His first words were fee fi fo fun. Time to bring on the chaser. It's the doctor and stand-up comedian. It's the cinema, Paul Sinha. Let's put some money on the table. Low offer off, please. Thanks and a high offer. What do you think? Now that I love. Here we go. The chase is on. Good luck, here comes your first question. Who was a 90s runner-up for BBC Sports Personality of the Year two years running? Correct answer is... Great start. Step close to home. Chaser has put. Goes right, also. Comes onto the table. All right, here's your next question. How old was Max Verstappen when he was the youngest ever F1 driver in 2015? Correct answer is... What an answer that was, well played. Let's step close to home. Chaser has put. Goes right also. Chaser sticks with us. And here's your next question. Which of these London venues has the oldest sporting museum? Correct answer is... Well played. Step close to home. Chaser has put. Goes right, also. Stays with us. Here's the next question. The corridor of uncertainty is a phrase most often used in which sport? Correct answer is... Very good. A step close to home. Chaser's put. Goes right, also. Chaser sticks with us. All right, here's your next question. What is the standard length of an Olympic velodrome track? Correct answer is... Great answer, well played. Step close to home. Pressure's on now, one step from home. Chaser has put... Goes right, also. Stays with us. Here's your next question. Artist Sam Taylorwood created a 67-minute video of which sportsman sleeping?
If that's right, you're going through. The correct answer is... Absolutely brilliant. This is the cash bill of the correct answer is worth a thousand pounds. Are you ready? Good luck, your time starts now. In boxing, holding an opponent to prevent them punching you is called what? Correct. Which of these racket sports uses the smallest ball? Correct. Which of these English horse races is not now run on a Saturday? Which of these is not allowed in a game of polo? Correct. Which three brothers played for England in the 2013 Rugby League World Cup? Roy Hodgson left what club to become England foot? Correct. King Constantine II of Greece won Olympic gold. Correct. A wax head is a devotee of what sport? Correct. The 1927 running of what horse race was the first to receive radio commentary? Put some money on the table. Take a step closer to home, the chaser will offer you. Take a step closer to the chaser and take him on, he will offer you. So, the choice, of course, is yours. What'll it be? I think that's great. I wish you luck. The chase is on. Good luck, here comes your first question. How wide is a field hockey goal? Correct answer is... Great start. Step closer home. Chasers put. Goes right also. Comes onto the table. All right, here's your next question. Who defeated Steffi Graf to win the 1992 Olympic women's singles title? The correct answer is... Well played. Step close to home. Chaser has put. Goes right also. Chaser sticks with us. Good luck, here's next question. Which of these men captained the England cricket team the earliest? The correct answer is... No! Chase has put... Goes right. Chase is breathing down her neck. And here's your next question. Which of these Wimbledon champions was born closest to the All England club? It's got to be right. Correct answer is... What an answer that was. Well played. Three steps from home now. Chasers put. Goes right also. Stays with us. All right, here's your next question. Argentina's Boca Juniors is the first club to offer their fans what facility? Correct answer is, this has got to be right. Very good. Two steps from home. Chaser has put. Goes right also. Chaser sticks with us. And here's your next question. In 2012, which of these was made a Knight of the Order of the Lion of Finland? got to be right. The correct answer is... Well played. 
step closer to home. One more and we're through. Chaser has put. Goes right also. Stays with us. Uh, here's your next question. In athletics, the women's world sprint records were all set in what decade? If this is right, we are through. Correct answer is... Sensational. This is the cash build around. Each correct answer is worth a thousand pounds. Wish you luck. Your time starts now. Which of these Formula One world champions won the title at the youngest age? Correct. What Canadian city hosted the Winter Olympics and Commonwealth Games? Correct. Which of these football grounds is furthest north? Correct. Which of these sports does not feature at the World Aquatics Championships? Which of these states has never competed at the Olympics? Correct. Who was the youngest player in the England 1966 World Cup winning team? Correct. Which of these British sports stars won Olympic gold at the shortest distance? Correct. Which horse won the English and Scottish Grand National? Correct. Which of these darts scores is the highest? Out of time. Terrific. Let's put some money on the table. Low offer off, please. High offer, please. What do you think? Now that I love. Here we go. The chase is on. Good luck, here comes your first question. Who was the first footballer to win BBC Sports Personality of the Year? Correct answer is... Great start. Step closer home. Chaser has put. Goes right also. Chaser comes onto the table. Good luck. Here's next question. The 2012 book, The Secret Race, is a whistle blowing account of which sport? Correct answer is. Very good. A step close home. Chase is put. Goes right also. Chase sticks with us. And here's your next question. Who did Virginia Wade beat to win the Wimbledon Ladies Singles title? Correct answer is. What an answer that was. Well played. Three steps from home now. Chaser has put. Goes right also. Stays with us. Good luck. Here's next question. Who did Andy Murray beat to win his first two Grand Slam tennis championships? Correct answer is... Very good. Step closer home. Chaser has put. That's good for us. Game opens up. Here's your next question. Which of these London Premier League clubs is the oldest? Correct answer is... Well played. Step closer home. Pressure's on now. One step from home. Chaser's put. Goes right also. Chaser sticks with us. Uh, here's your next question. 
Which of these places in Russia is not a host city for the 2018 FIFA World Cup? If that's right, you're going through. Correct answer is... Absolutely brilliant. This is the cash builder round. Each correct answer is worth a thousand pounds. Your time starts now. The 1828 Epsom Derby had the race's first what? Correct. Which ex-boxer is often seen wearing a monocle riding boots and a bowler hat? Correct. Which former singles champion won two doubles titles at Wimbledon 2015? Correct. If an athlete wears the initials KSA, what country are they representing? Correct. Historically a boxer's corner could throw in what instead of the towel? Correct. Which of these footballers won the most caps for England? Correct. The 2013 America's Cup took place off the coast of which California city? Correct. Which female sports presenter was formerly a leading athlete? Correct. Matthew Webb used what stroke to become the first man to swim the channel? Out of time. Very nice indeed. Put some money on the table. Uh, step close to home, get you an offer of. Take a step closer to the chaser and take him on. He will offer you. So, the choice... Well, good for you. Are you sure? I wish you luck. The chase is on. Good luck, here comes your first question. The 1949-2000 Guineas was the first classic horse race to use what? Correct answer is... Great start. Step close to home. Chaser has put. Goes right also. Comes onto the table. All right, here's your next question. Which bowler has taken the most wickets in Ashes cricket? Correct answer is... Well played. Four steps from home. Chaser has put. Goes right also. Stays with us. Uh, here's your next question. Which of these was first introduced as a medal sport at the 1964 Olympics? Correct answer is... What an answer that was. Well played. A step close to home. Chase has put. Goes right also. Chase sticks with us. And here's your next question. Which UK city bid unsuccessfully for the 1996 and 2000 Summer Olympics? Correct answer is... Well played. Two steps from home. Chaser has put. Goes right also. Stays with us. Good luck, here's next question. At the Beijing and London Olympics, Team GB's first medal came in what sport? Correct answer is... Bad luck. Chase has put... Goes right. Chase has moved to one behind. All right, here's your next question. Actor Robert Mitchum was also a professional in which sport? Correct answer is, this has got to be right. 
Well played. Step close to home. One more with home and dry. Chaser's put. Goes right also. Chaser sticks with us. Uh, here's your next question. Which palace was the start and end point of the 2012 Olympic cycling time trial? If this is right, we are through. Correct answer is... Nice. Time for the final chase. Wish you luck. Your time starts now. In 1971, which football team was the last to win the Fairs Cup? Correct. Which former England rugby player won Celebrity Masterchef? Correct. The equipment brand Everlast is famously associated with which sport? Between 1973 and 2006, which tennis star played in 325 matches? Correct. Who won the 2012 BBC Sports Personality of the Year Lifetime Achievement Award? Correct. In the Winter Olympics, a biathlon combines cross-country skiing with what? Correct. In 1967, which English golfer scored the first live hole in one on British TV? Correct. Which actor was London schoolboy boxing champion three times? Correct. Who won the Wimbledon women's singles title when she was just 17 years old? How many consecutive pots does a snooker player have to make for a 147 break? Correct. Who won 22 Grand Slam tennis singles titles between 1980s? Manuel Neuer of Germany won which award at the 20... Correct. Jonah Lomu famously played which sport? Correct. What first name links Ryder Cup golfers Broadhurst Casey and Laurie? Correct. What is the only Olympic throwing event not executed from within a circle? Correct. Gary Lineker played most professional games for which club? Correct. Which was the second city to hold the Summer Olympics twice? What term is used in American football for a close grouping of... Correct. Which Olymp... Time to bring back the chaser. Chaser, your time starts now. Which England rugby player called the RFU committee 57 old farts? Correct. In 2015, which footballer married Towie star Georgina Dorset? Correct. What is the title of Jeff Hurst's autobiography? Correct. The catchphrase of boxing MC Michael Buffer is, let's get ready to what? Correct. Grappler is a nickname for what sort of professional sportsman? Correct. Who was the last player to win a Grand Slam singles title with a wooden racket? Stop, stop. Take your time, take your time. It's correct, we push the chaser back. Here we go. Your time starts again now. Since 1711, the summer race meeting at which course has been a royal occasion? Correct. From 1977 to 1987, American Edwin Moses was undefeated in what athletics event? Correct. In tenpin bowling, what is the front pin in the triangular arrangement called? Correct. Nigel Benn and Chris Eubank both won world boxing titles at what weight? Correct. Which middle distance athlete was nicknamed the Jarrow Arrow? Correct. Who won the ladies singles at Wimbledon five times between 2000 and 2008? Correct. Who usually presents the green jacket to the US Masters Golf Tournament winner? Correct. What was the nickname of Red Rum trainer Donald McCain? Correct. What was the first country to host the Summer Olympics twice? 
correct. In 1997, which golfer was 21 years old when he won his first US Masters title? Correct. Which sportswear company's logo features a man and woman sitting back to back? Correct. A volume of whose autobiography is called My Decade in the Premier League? Correct. The area at Wimbledon called Hemon Hill is also referred to as Murray. Correct. Jump, serve, pancake, and power. Time is up! Very, very good indeed. Uh, congratulations.